Antidepressants are medications that can help relieve symptoms of depression, social anxiety disorder, anxiety disorders, seasonal affective disorder, and dysthymia, or mild chronic depression, as well as other conditions. They aim to correct chemical imbalances of neurotransmitters in the brain that are believed to be responsible for changes in mood and behavior. Antidepressants were first developed in the 1950s. Their use has become progressively more common in the last 20 years. According to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention CDC, the percentage of people aged 12 years and over using antidepressant in the United States rose from 7.7% in 1999 to 2002 to 12.7% in 2011 to 2014. Around twice as many females use antidepressants as males. These are the most commonly prescribed type of antidepressant. Serotonin and noradrenaline reuptake inhibitors SNRIs, are used to treat major depression, mood disorders, and possibly but less commonly attention deficit hyperactivity disorder ADHD, obsessive compulsive disorder OCD, anxiety disorders, menopausal symptoms, fibromyalgia, and chronic neuropathic pain. SNRIs raise levels of serotonin and norepinephrine, two neurotransmitters in the brain that play a key role in stabilizing mood. Examples include duloxetine, Cymbalta, venlafaxine, Effexor, and desvenlafaxine, Pristique. Selective serotonin reuptake inhibitors SSRIs, are the most commonly prescribed antidepressants. They are effective in treating depression, and they have fewer side effects than the other antidepressants. SSRIs block the reuptake, or absorption, of serotonin in the brain. This makes it easier for the brain cells to receive and send messages, resulting in better and more stable moods. They are called, selective, because they mainly seem to affect serotonin, and not the other neurotransmitters. Tricyclic antidepressants TCAs. Tricyclic antidepressants TCAs, are so named because there are three rings in the chemical structure of these medications. They are used to treat depression, fibromyalgia, some types of anxiety, and they can help control chronic pain. Monoamine oxidase inhibitors MAOIs. This type of antidepressant was commonly prescribed before the introduction of SSRIs and SNRIs. It inhibits the action of monoamine oxidase, a brain enzyme. Monoamine oxidase helps break down neurotransmitters, such as serotonin. If less serotonin is broken down, there will be more circulating serotonin. In theory, this leads to more stabilized moods and less anxiety. Doctors now use MAOIs if SSRIs have not worked. MAOIs are generally saved for cases where other antidepressants have not worked because MAOIs interact with several other medications and some foods. Subscribe to my YouTube channel Baby Time FYI thank you.